Hey guys, what's going on? This is Prod by Health, the Slayer candidate. Isn't this my voice? Isn't this weird? But if you went on my lifestyle channel, you would know my voice is D Heffer Reacts, Reactions, Travel Vlogs, uh, Street Walk Ups, Omega Mashups, Reactions, obviously, Anime and Music Video, Product Reviews, Clothing Hauls, you know. Check out my main uh, channel, Lifestyle Channel, D Hefe Reacts. You know, my name's Hefe. My name's Jeff. Hefe is a nickname made by my best friend, Pretty Boy CT, the heart of Boston, a rapper. But this video, you know. I actually do like maybe like problem solution videos. I did like one on Jump Force. Anybody ever played Jump Force, that anime Super Smash Bros. Brawl game on my lifestyle channel. But this is my first one on Prod by Hef. This is just mostly like an issue I had. I couldn't figure it out. And it wasn't anywhere on YouTube. So I thought, hey, why not make a video and post it on my channel where I make beats, you know, just because in case anybody has a similar issue. So if you have any type of VST, VST3, you know what I'm saying, and you downloaded the newest FL Studio um, and it doesn't show up. So let me just show you right now real quick. Um, just want to make sure it's showing yeah so let me just show you right now real quick right so this is FL Studio right so I use a lot of unison right like they just dropped the unison drum monkey and they also just dropped the unison midi wizard so shout out both of those those are elite you know I'm just open both up just to show you guys so if you downloaded the newest FL Studio I'm pretty sure this is from version um, this one just dropped September 16th uh, version um, I could even go right here and check and uh, about uh, this is version 20 version 20.8.4 20 um, build 2072 so this is the newest uh, version of FL studio made I think last month or September you know I'm a Libra baby so my birthday September 30th um, but yeah bro so with it right I guess um, Fuck you, it. Uh, uh, damn. you could see right here it says Apple silicon so it this is the native build for this newest version so how it works is they actually have two builds they have apple silicon and apple rosetta and it's just um so if your vsts after you update after you updated fl studio if your vsts right just aren't working all too well like look it's it's just, it's already glitching you know what i'm saying um if i do uk drill right let's just okay let's just do how since it's glitching so bad right I'm supposed to be able to hear it, so I can't even hear my pattern, let alone drag the MIDI or audio. Shout out Unison, you know, definitely a big fan of them. Definitely go check out their stuff. And then even MIDI Wizard, which I use to make my melodies and chords, it's not even opening. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, what's going on? I just updated it last night. Like, I've been had these licenses. Why isn't it working? Basically, you have to switch it from the Silicon to the Rosetta version. Man, quit playing with me, man. No, for real, don't play like that. So the newest edition has two versions. It has Apple Silicon and it has Apple Rosetta. So in order to get your VSTs to show up or at least work in the newest version, if you're having these difficulties, you know, if you're not, then who cares? But I guess the Rosetta version, um, you could they recognize all VSTs. Oh, and um, in the native version, you could automatically, my bad, switch to that when you update to the newest version, you know, the version I just showed you. If you go to more plugins, and then you go to... Um, like, let's say, right, I go to manage plugins, right? So, that's saying error. It's not even picking them up, my guy. You know what I'm saying? Because it's on the um, the native or, yeah, the native uh, version of the newest FL Studio. So, what you got to do, right, you have to go to uh, Finder. You got to go to applications. You got to right click on FL Studio. You got to get press get info. And then, see, you just got to click this box open using Rosetta. You don't got to do anything else. Put that on everything. You just got to do open using Rosetta, right? And then all you got to do is literally restart FL Studio. I know, bro. It took me low-key like a few hours to figure this out. I was like, I need to make a video and post it on Proud by Half because, you know, maybe someone else could have be having the same exact issues as me. And they're thinking it's them and they're messaging people that literally have no way of solving it, you know. And it's so simple. It's on image line, but, like, it's a lot of research compared to just watching this one YouTube video. So, you know, I just thought it would be easier if I just visually showed you guys, right? So now when I do it right, it's not glitching. I could choose any genre. Not only could I hear the pattern, which is what I was supposed to hear in the first place, but I could also drag it out like how it was to begin with. So I guess, and even here, just to show you real quick, if you go to um, about the change to Rosetta, right? It's the same newest version, it just changed Rosetta. So I guess this makes it so they could um, recognize foreign VST3 plugins or foreign VST plugins that FL Studio didn't uh, uh, can't see to begin with. Okay. I guess that's how they described it. I don't know how they described it, but just switch here. You know, I just showed you how to do it through Finder, and um, your VST should work. Um, let me just make sure the other one works, even though I know it does. I knew that before I filmed this, you know. So, you know, um, anything would work. You know, this is the MIDI Wizard um, 
definitely recommend Unison, you know, it really helps my sound, but yeah, so, you know, this is definitely, um, all you gotta do, bro, that's all you gotta do, bro, so I just, I hope that helped, uh, definitely subscribe to Proud by Happy, check out my lifestyle channel, and subscribe there to have your reacts, we up next, Boston, baby, woo, Beantown, Red Sox, Celtics, let's go!